Oh. Camby Brown joins us live from Galt with more. Hey, Camby, what's up? Good morning. So I don't know if you guys know, but I'm now NAS a wedding planner because uh -oh. if you can't plan your own, you should plan someone else's. Right. And so okay. I found this great floral arrangement that they do here at Gull FFA. And so oh. not only that do they do these great floral arrangements, they do them for weddings, for funerals. They also do things uh, for like homecoming and the dances. If uh, people need their corsages or the boutonnieres, you guys do that too. I mean, like you're working on a bouquet right now, right? How long does this take you to get good at this? Because you're in the advanced class. Yeah. Um, it basically takes takes uh, like about 10 to 15 minutes to do one perfectly. Yeah. Uh, basically, you start off with uh, the flowers and whatever they want, the, like the uh, filler flowers, anything, decorations, and uh, you create it. And it doesn't take that much, but it depends how much the order is. Yeah. And do you think you want to do this for your career, possibly? It, yeah, it can possibly be a career. Or maybe something that you could do on the side, too, right? Maybe like a side hustle as, an, as another business? Yeah, I think that would be good. Yeah, and yeah. so how long did it take you to be able to get good at this? I know the arrangement itself took about 15 minutes, yeah. but this would take me a lot longer than 15 minutes. Did it take like a year, a couple months? Yeah, it took me one year for the... Uh, the beginning of floral uh, class, yeah. like the elements of and principles of floral, and it took me that whole year to actually get good at it, good at it and learn everything. So. Yeah, and you're really good now. She actually did these floral arrangements as well. You can see some of the other students that are out here this morning. You'll notice those fresh eggs. We showed you the chickens in the earlier hour. Uh, at 7:30, the kids get here right before school starts. About 30 minutes before, take care of those chickens, and then they actually deliver the eggs twice a week. If you want to get in on that, and they have these great programs, and that's why they won big. They just got back from Indianapolis two weeks ago, and uh, Mr. Blanco or Mr. White. It would, depending on what the kids call, some kids call you Mr. Bunko, mm -hmm. some kids call you Mr. White. True, you true. guys just got back from Indianapolis, and you won something that the state has never won before, we right? We did. We won. It's called the Agriculture Issues Forum National Championship. It's a huge contest um, where you analyze a, a big issue in agriculture, and we analyze the Trans-Pacific Trade Partnership, which we're hearing about in the debates right now. Yeah. So it's pretty cool to have some high school kids look at the pros and cons of a big issue. But your chapter also won big, too. I mean, the, we, the, the nation yeah. is basically saying you guys are one of the best in our country. We did. We won what's called a three-star national chapter award rating. So under 40 chapters in the uh, whole country will get that and there's 3,600 FFA programs in America. So it's a pretty big deal for us. We're very proud. Yeah, now one of you guys wanted to be an ag teacher. I forget who it was, but you, was it you, LSAO? Yes, LSAO said that he wants to be an ag teacher, and that is because amazing teachers like Katie and uh, Mr. White that are here helping the students and a uh, humble brag over here. <laughs> Mr. White doesn't want you to know. I know, look, he's already getting embarrassed. But he was like a national spokesperson for FFA <laughs> after he got out of high school. He is totally so blushing. So he went to college in Chico and then came here to Galt. He thought it would be a couple years. How long has it been now? Ten years? Uh, rocking a uh, full decade. Yeah. yeah. He's not going anywhere. He is not, he's not going anywhere. <laughs> there you go. I love it. It's so great. So great. Thank, Thank you, Camby. Thanks, Camby. Thank you all this morning. Mm -hmm. Hey, trying to make the most out of your living space.